I snapped my fingers and I was in space, how would I die? Turns Probably shouldn't do that. Out, most sci-fi gets this wrong. Your first problem is gonna be there's no atmosphere. Yeah, rapid depressurization. The pressure difference between inside and outside of your body would immediately cause all of the air to just rush on out of you. Explosive levels of depressurization outside of your mouth and your nose. Kind of like a poorly vented reactor pressure vessel. Gotta release pressure safe there, catastrophic failure will occur. But don't hold your breath because then your lungs might then in about 15 seconds, yep. your brain would stop getting the leftover oxygen from your blood, so you black out. Which that is one good thing. You'd lose awareness quickly before all the really bad stuff happens. Probably good because your body would be swelling up since the lower pressure would start to lower the boiling point of the water inside of your blood. Your blood will boil. And tissues. You're turning not, it to you won't freeze. Inside of you. Your next problem is going to be temperature. Because there's no atmosphere, there's no ambient temperature around you. But if you were in the sun, the light... I mean, you'd be gone at this point. No oxygen, brain shuts down. Cells are going to start dying, but I guess your skin will be intact. It would make that side of your body heat up to potentially 150 degrees Celsius, while simultaneously the other side of your body would be slowly freezing down to negative 150. You wouldn't actually freeze, though. Heat removal is only going to be by thermal radiation. Degrees. And if somehow you managed to survive all of that, you would be getting so blasted by radiation that it would probably poison you and give you cancer. It wouldn't be green or anything, but yeah, high dose from UVs, from cosmic rays, much of which will be from the sun, but way less lethal than the other symptoms. And eventually you might get shred to bits by flying objects going faster than bullets. Over time, what's left of you? You'll be long gone by then, though.